Friday, June 10th at 5 p.m. This is going to be your walkthrough video so you can see all the really cool, cool items that we have for this week. Uh, this picture here is a signed V. Morris of 1987. Uh, we have fantasy cards, all kinds of cool stuff, guys. So hang in here with me on this preview video. The good thing is the way the video goes is the order we're going to run the auction in. So you have a pretty good idea of when your treasures are going to run. So make sure that you are tuned in live Friday at 5 p.m. right here. Bronstein Auction Company. Guys, our inspection is Thursday night from 6 to 8 p.m. And Friday from 2 to 4 p.m. Those are our inspection hours where you can come in and see these items in person. And I highly suggest that you do that. This way you get to see exactly what you're buying. You get to measure it, check it, etc., etc. If you can't make it in for inspection, guys, give us a call. We will be happy to help you. Give you a video walkthrough, take you close-ups, you know, check a brand name, etc., etc. for you. Um, and also, if you can't be on at auction time, we can bid for you. And that's a great thing. We can do a proxy bid for you guys. So... If you can't be on the auction, you know, make sure that you are definitely able to connect with us and we'll bid for you. But please don't call it five to five and try to put in left bids, um, proxy bids, because it's really not the time to do it. So get with us early. If you're here for inspection, you know you can't be on for the auction. You can have Sarah or Jen or I actually put the, you know, get those bids in for you. And if you can't be in... If you can't make inspection, we'll be happy to uh, look and check things out for you a little bit better and closer. And also can take your left bids at that point. You can screenshot it and text it to us. All right, here we go. We have just an amazing, amazing amount of really cool stuff. This is a Franco artwork signed. Bringing it down, we have the Keurig. We have Orlando Magic Balls. We have the Star Planetarium. Uh, just all kinds of neat collectibles. It's really cool tree that not even a guy can kill. All right, bringing it on down and around, we have uh, custom frames. These frames are brand spanking new, custom handmade. We've got a lot of really cool custom handmade items from a local business here in or Longwood. Uh, gentlemen make some really cool items. You're going to see we've got dog bowls and dog beds and cool stuff coming up. Uh, bringing it on around here, we have this entire table of vintage games. Anybody remember Operation? <clears throat> I thought that was the coolest game in the world. All right, we're going to bring it on over here. We have a projection clock from Brookstone. We have bakeware, the whole lot of bakeware, guys. This is some really heavy-duty stuff. Let me get you a shot of the bottom here so you can get a look. Yep, really, really nice stuff. Looks in really good condition. And get you a shot over here. This one, some really nice pieces, guys. This is some amazing bakeware. Bringing it on down, we have the universal ornaments. We have some really cool uh, glassware, collectibles, cake plates, uh, dog toys, and dog cool stuff, and all kinds of doggy stuff. Uh, custom wood box and saws, vintage saws. We've got the computer. Have it plugged up and running for you for inspection. Uh, the really cool France picture right here, the France on Bognor. Yes, let me zoom in there on that. Looks like it has a signature. Bringing it back out, we have more of the Mickey ears. We have the X-Files trading cards. Really, really cool. Now, I'm taking a little longer. Ew, God, really? Phew. All right. Can you imagine having worms coming out of your ears? Uh, I'm taking a little longer on these videos, guys. In the event, you can't make it in for inspection, so you can see more of the items. Uh, the way we're doing it. So, yeah, definitely giving you a little heavy-duty inspection preview here. Uh, handmade signs. We have these really cool red vases and stuff. We have a nice home light trimmer. Beautiful little sofa table. Whole box of kids' books. Really, really cool right there. And bringing it over here, we have Mom's Mall Money, etc., etc. A whole lot of neat stuff in there. Bringing it on down, we have the little kitty dolls dressed up in their poo outfits. How cute are they? Let me get you over here. They even have some little booklets with them, so that'll kind of give you an idea of what they're all about. 
bringing it on over. We got some other cool collectibles and little teacups, etc. We got Goofy. We have all kinds of Disney looking stuff here. The whole, whole, whole flat full. Check it out, guys. Lots of cool stuff right in on there. And bringing it out, we've got the two matching. Uh, they're kind of like bookcases, storage shelves. Uh, those actually have file cabinet in the bottom of them. Sunglasses. No, you guys don't like sunglasses, but we have them. Uh, nice little plant stand table. This on-wall component shelf. Pretty cool. Brand new in the box. And we're going to come around here. Yep, checking it out. We have another one of those custom-made brand new frames, guys. Those are really, really cool. These are super intricate. Uh, handmade beautiful look at this easel wow check this baby out right here really nice piece all right we're gonna bring it on over and bring it on in we have the whole top shelf here the easter bunnies the giggle buddies all that fun stuff and we have more sunglasses guys this is gonna be a heck of a sale for sunglasses got some really nice lots of them bring it on down we have more mickey ears and over here, we're getting ready for Christmas. Amen. Christmas is coming. It's going to be here before we know it, I'll tell you what, right? And another whole lot of Christmas. And so, guys, you know the drill on the Christmas stuff, you know? This is the time of year to buy it because you buy it now and you sell it again at Christmas time and you make money. Uh, we've got decor galore. We have kitchen items galore. This really cool uh, jungle seat. Look at, look, look at the carving on this. That's actually animals on the back. That's an elephant, a uh, horse, oh, probably a donkey. And it's a chair. All right, look at this. We have an entire toy box full of, guess what? Toys, books, s'mores, you name it. Books of dolphins and sharks and building blocks and footballs and all kinds of good stuff. Get your kids into sports and having fun. We won't have some of the problems we're having with kids these days, right? All right, we have flat screen TVs, DVD players by the lot loads. I'm going to round the bend here. And we have more universal ornaments. We have this really cool custom wall art built from good hardwoods. Really cool vintage cabinet. Bring it on over here. We've got a nice dog bowl set. This is cool. That's brand spanking new. And check out the bench tables. Um, got this beautiful, absolutely stunning. I don't know how I'm going to get back here. Absolutely stunning outdoor patio set. We have the sangria set right here. And we have a London burger basket. Yes. I know it's Lana Burger, guys. I just love to say London Burger because it gets people antsy and stuff. Look on the inside. Nice and clean Lana Burger basket. Uh, more outdoor patio furniture. We have some really nice rugs. Came out of a beautiful home. We have bottle collectibles, beer bottle collectibles. We got Dobler, Dobler, Dobler Ale. You name it. We got Dobler, Dobler Amber. All right, we have a desk, a chair. Check it out, put you to work, right? This very nice dresser with the mirror. And we're gonna bring it on over here. We have the kitchen stuff and the uh, Coke stuff and a spice rack, all in a nice big lot there for you. Uh, Villarian Bach, Villarian Bach. We have the kettle and the cooker. This beautiful, beautiful plate. This sucker is probably two and a half foot by two and a half foot. And bring it over here. We have some really cool little nightstands. These really nice spaceship looking glass top tables. We have a lot of really old Hess trucks. These babies are the oldies. Back when the truckers' trucks had the front flat face. All right, we've got a nice, nice um, sofa entry table. Got the couples, the cool couples right here. One's got a tiny little chip on it. It didn't hurt it none, I imagine. But, uh, yeah, little chip on that one. That, uh, naked couples dancing. Decor galore. TV stands. More outdoor patio stuff. Really nice stuff this week, guys. And I haven't even scratched the surface. We're not even a quarter of the way through the items we have. We have over 400 items for this sale. We have this whole lot of floor lamps and lamps and lamps and lamps and lamps. And this really cool, cool computer desk. This really wild pink kid's dresser. Nice for a little girl. Uh, decor lot. And yes, and rugs. We have more rugs. We are loaded with rugs, guys. Nice clean ones, though. They came out of some beautiful homes. And we're going to go ahead and round the bend over here for you to show you some more really amazing items. And yes. 
We have bins of wrap. Wrap and wrap and wrap. Christmas wrap. And we have door hangers. Yes, check it out. Bring it on over here. We have the frame lot. Uh, custom table, brand new, made, fresh made, custom made with a metal base. We have a Paula Dean uh, cooking thingy. Uh, you know what I mean. It's for pasta and stuff, right? Look at that. Look at how nice and clean inside. Clean Paula Dean. All right, here we go. We have a whole thing of the chefs. Chef, is that my dad? You remember the episode of, Car or of uh, South Park where Cartman was trying to figure out who his dad was? He thought Chef was his dad. All right, bring it on over here. Check these out. Get you a picture of the bottom. We got some really cool stuff. And then on the bottom shelf, we have some uh, really nice metal serving pieces. We have golf clubs, windows, you name it. Yo-yos, mines, 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 mines. Hmm, okay. Oh, look at this. We have Tommy Bahama hats, brand new, or Panama Jack. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you almost got you there. You almost told me, yep. All right, we have toys in a rack and all kinds of stuff that entire lot. We've got the cooker, a really nice cooker, outdoor fryer, really nice, guys. And more kids' toys galore, ready to go to work for you. We have the custom wall art. These are brand new, guys, cool little... Uh, Death to the ankles down from the ankles down. That's funny. Cool dog thingies. We have this really cool desk. We have the cat pictures, the cat wall hangings. It's really nice baskets, all handmade. Great stuff. We have a train set with the basket included. Well, look, check out these dog beds. These babies are brand new, guys. These are really, really cool. We have some cozy pooches. And yes, bringing it on up. Some more good solid wood, um, hardwood wall art. Uh, nice pair of tables here with metal legs, glass tops, uh, another nice pair of tables, and a pair of uh, lantern holders. And then we have, I believe these are skylights, so it's a metal and glass skylights, a uh, pair of metal wall hangings. God, we got a pair and a pair and a pair of, pair of everything right here. When are we going to get off the pairs, right? All right, look at these babies. You got the nice wood toolbox or decor box, a nice uh, tabletop box, another beautiful needs a little cleaning it needs to be wiped down a little bit but a little dusty but another beautiful outdoor patio set and bringing it over here we have all the bedding and pillows the entire lot very clean very nice got a queen bed and a bag back there and we're gonna rock it around right around here we have a whole bunch of lamps and we're gonna bring it down here we have some custom wall art in the box custom made Beautiful, beautiful vintage dresser. Absolutely stunning with the mirror. Um, bring it on over here. We've got the nice, uh, I think that's a full-size bed. Um, yeah, beautiful, beautiful piece. Nice vintage full-size bed. Just for a hint, hint kind of matches that. Bringing it on over here. We have a mirror and a picture together. Nice stuff. And mini golf indoor. We have shelves. We have triangle lighting tables uh, nice vanity that matches the bedroom set along with a gorgeous nightstand we have some uh, overalls whatever and we have rebounders and kids toys and cars and all kinds of cool stuff like that uh, really nice and uh, we have the uh, chest wicker chest wicker wicker desk dolls more of the custom wall hangings bikes yep 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 we got a hyper bike right here and we got a Roadmaster Graphite. Really nice, guys. Come on and check them out. It's got a little damage on the seat. But, hey, I would use one of the regular seats anyway. I think they were a pain in the ass. Literally. All right, bring it on over here. We've got some baby stuff. We have cradles. We have changing tables. Pokemon games. Monopoly. Uh, Three-wheel jogging stroller. Bed in a bag. Or you know, whatever you go. Pack and play. Uh, cool uh, vintage-looking cart pieces. Yeah, it's really cool stuff. Look at that bench. That's really neat. We have a thing of small matchbox type cars, a yoke. We have the metal wall hanging, another metal wall hanging. And we're just getting going, guys. So we're just rounding the house into the main house right here. We have the DVDs. We have a huge piece of gorgeous art right here. CDs galore. Absolutely loaded up CD lot. 
Bring it over here. We have some more great artwork. We have two bins of toys galore. It is toy week. Look at that T-Rex. A nice little runner airy rug, probably a 4x6 or 3x5, 4x6, probably 4x6. Brunilda's looking hot this week. She's been wearing it. She's sporting it, guys. Wee-woo. Yep. She's got the uh, reddish blondish brunette and sporting a dress. She's kind of hanging out on the side. All right, shelf one right here. Everything you see on the shelf there will be going as one lot. Everything you see on that shelf will be going as one lot. Everything you see on that shelf will be going as one lot. Bring it on over. We've got some great artwork, a really nice uh, armoire uh, type deal here. This is the kind you want. It's got the drawers in it, so you definitely like that kind. Uh, nice and lightweight. We're going to bring it back over here. We're going to have choice on the, I don't know if these are Chrome, but well, Intel. They're Lenovo's. They don't Lenovo mini uh, laptops. I do not have chargers for them. The one does power up, though, but uh, I don't have the chargers. And bring it over here. We have a Beamer watch, BMW watch, a Seiko, Seiko pulsometer. Uh, this one right here, this is something really cool, and I'm not sure, but there's a sleeper in here, guys. This guy. Anybody know him? Way back from the 40s, so something's up with that. Uh, do your research, and we have Baby Bonds. We have James Bond, we have Baby Bonds. We have Refrigerant 410, a whole brand new container of it. That sucker is heavy. All right, bring you down over here. We have the brand new, these are brand new uh, AC vents, or return vents. And we have some really cool stainless uh, garbage cans, flip lids. We have this beautiful armoire and dark wood right here. More DVDs, jam loaded with DVDs, guys, this week. This is a fun, fun week. There's some good stuff in there, too. Uh, we have all these heater coils. They're going to go as a whole lot. I believe there's six of them in the lot. Uh, some of them are new. Some of them look like they're used. You're buying a whole kit and caboodle of them. All right, 234 right here, 234A. We have a nice toolbox loaded up with gauges and all kinds of AC stuff. So that's going to be a cool lot right there. Bring it on over here. We're going to do the flyover. We have all the games. Check it out. Games, games, games galore. Artwork galore. Check it out. Really cool uh, city art and mirrors. Good looking auctioneers. Hey, that kind of rhymes. I could be a poet. Made a comment about that at the car auction earlier today. Got some good laughs out of that one. Uh, 235, we have size 3 and size 4. Rydell roller skates, both in very nice shape. Again, if you don't bid enough, very bad things are going to happen to you. Or you're going to get Ash wednesday -ed. All right, guys, lots of DVDs, a whole kit and caboodle. We have the whole kit and caboodle of thimbles, of course, not including our uh, wood wine box. Harry Potter training cards. Potter. We're loaded with Potter. Look at this. Just absolutely loaded book of Potter trading cards. And we've got this really cool piece, which I'm not sure what it is. I would call it like a gong, but it looks like a half a gong. All right, bringing it on over here, we have the Panasonic TV, 55 inch maybe. I'll get you measurements by auction time for that with a remote. We'll get that baby plugged up for you. Nice. All right, look here, we have cameras and video cameras and digital photo albums and all kinds of neat stuff. Just a good lot of camera stuff there. We've got the Lennox Angel, she's a beauty. And Tiffany and Co. plate and some really cool dolphins. I think they're wood. And we're going to rock it around the clock here and come in. We have another really beautiful piece of solid wood artwork. And this gorgeous piece right here. And we're going to rock you around the corner here. All right. So, you have this beautiful display case. Yep, lighted display case. Very nice piece. Glass shelves. Uh, nice uh, bookcase speaker uh, stereo system. We have the Hunt, the Berkshire Hunt. And then we have the salad spinner. And we're going to bring it around here. We have this really nice piece of art right here. That is a Linda Roberts. Linda Roberts Harmony at Hunter. Hunter Hell. Hunter Hill, Hunter Hill, yes. 
Okay, I was like, Hunter Hill? I don't want to go to Hunter Hill. All right, here we go. We have these beautiful glass pieces, the Rocket Fish rechargeable uh, wireless stereo headphones. Some really cool, lots of really, really nice costuming jewelry right here. We're even selling the glass and metal shelf. That's a really nice piece as well. We have a lot of the brand new uh, kitchen appliances this week, which should be really good for you. And we're going to bring it back. There's a wall there. Bring it out. We have this nice table set. And we're going to go in the back there. We have the angel pictures, an oster mixer, uh, some other really nice pictures, really cool mantle clock here, more universal ornaments. We have a uh, CD, CW Wilson uh, Yelpy Dog ankle biter. And <laughs> we have an Izolic Plexiglass Zebra. This is this is pretty darn cool right here. Check that out. Reverse Plexiglass Zebra and Izolic right there, signed. Uh, we have the... Um, Lava lamp, we'll get it plugged in so it looks lobby. And some beautiful vases and collectibles and lots of mirrors. That's another gorgeous framed mirror. Nice tapestry right here and the, no comment, swing. <laughs> I'm not sure what you do with that. It's a chair, yeah, we'll call it a chair. All right, we have a brand new little foot hassock right there, brand new off the semi. We have some nice Star Wars, Queen of and la, 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 Amadilla. Amadala, Amadala, not Amadilla, not an armadillo. We have Santa tins, they're playing cards. Ah, uh, look here, Cole Anthony. We've got the magic above all. And then we've got a signed COA. God, look how young those guys look. And another big TV, probably 65 or 75 inch. We'll get that measured up for you too, guys. Ornaments cool electronics we have an airport extreme uh uniden uniden what does it do looks like a uh is that a scanner yeah it looks like a scanner guys how cool is that uh frogger look at that frogger controller belkin uh we've got some games really really cool i'll flip you around here another laptop we have an hp laptop and we have a really nice Swiss Army um, laptop bag. And bringing it out, another nice patio set. We're jam uploaded with patio sets. We have AMC pan sets. These are really cool, guys. Yeah, if they're not brand new, but they're certainly close to it. All right, I'm going to walk you over here. We have another little two-piece patio set with the high back chairs. This beautiful bong. I mean, vase. You guys know I joke about drugs, but I do not advocate the use of drugs. I do not even advocate the use of excessive alcohol, at that matter. Uh, look at this subwoofer and speakers, Logitech set. Damn, that would, like, knock you out of the park. Oh, look at this. I think it actually has... Uh... Huh, interesting. It kind of looks like a computer set, but I guess you could use it with uh, your stereo or you could use it with your TV. Uh, nice flat screen. We have a 12-cup coffee maker, new in the box. Some really nice furniture. Absolutely stunning. Gorgeous lamps. All kinds of cool lamps this week. Uh, Faberware air fryer. Uh, we have a shell lot. It shells and all these uh, crystal pieces and everything that's in them. Nice pair of nightstands. So, this is the place to be, guys. Brownstein Auction Company. Every Friday night at 5 p.m., we go live virtual with our auction. What is the meaning of live virtual? Live virtual means I call the sale just like you're in the room, but you're home safely and comfortably in your own home, watching the auction, bidding in real time against real bidders. Yep, it's fun. You see every, everything that's going on. It's just like you're sitting in the room bidding against your neighbor there, except for you're sitting behind your computer at home. And you know, it's cool. And we at first we had to do it, you know, during the uh, pandemic stuff. And... You know, it was like, oh, you can't have that many people in a room, da 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 da. And then everybody started saying, hey, this is really cool. We get to actually spend more time with our kids, you know, while we're doing the auction. Because let's face it, guys, I'm only cool to the kids for about 15 or 20 minutes with the fast talking. And then they've got other things they want to do. They want to play the video games, you know, stuff like that. So 
I'm only cool for a few minutes to the kids. So they, they, you know, people are like, hey, you know, I get to have dinner with my kids while we're having the auction. They're sitting on the couch with me. They're watching. But, you know, it's not the same as having to keep the kids, you know, at an auction house till 11 o'clock at night. And other people are telling me, hey, I can work on my business proposals or I can be taking school while I'm watching the auction. And everybody decided this is the way to go. And you know what? We get to sell more items in the night, too, which is really exciting because that way you guys get more stuff that you want without having to, uh... yeah, here we are. Okay, I didn't want to get out of track here. You get to buy more stuff, and then you get all day, 10 to 4 on Saturday, to come pick up your Tabasco picture. How cool is that? You know, it used to be, my God, when we were doing Thursday nights, we wanted you here by 8 to noon on Friday because we had to turn around and set it up again for Saturday, and it was like, Everybody was just under too much pressure. It was tough. You know, we didn't have time to, you know, have a quick conversation with you guys and stuff. It was like, we got to go. We got to work. Got to, got to, got to, got to, got to, got to roll. And it was like, hmm, deep silver. Uh, much better this way. So it was a blessing in disguise that we went to the live virtual. But we didn't want to lose that community because this is one hell of an auction community. You know, over the years of doing this business, We've, uh, you know, done the toy drives at Christmas. We've done the food drives at Thanksgiving. The toy box has caught on to, you know, where you guys donate throughout the year and we donate it to a few different charities or directly to families, you know, when they're having hard times or, you know, uh, some, sometimes a couple of weeks ago, we've had some really amazing people brought some items in and just said, you know what, donate my proceeds. And we turn that into gift cards or something or an envelope of cash that ends up going to a family in need when they're in need. And that's what a community is all about. You know, we're all here for each other. Now that we don't always agree on everything. We don't always agree on the same politics and everything else. I think we can all agree the, the price of fuel right now really is, a, is out of control, but we don't have to agree. We, we all got each other's backs. We're all, all in this business. So, you know, either you're a reseller or you just buy for cool stuff for yourself. But you know, we're all in business to uh, to see each other succeed, and and we've got a great community here. But that was the point. My point, and I got a little off track. You know, praising you guys for what an amazing community we have. Um, but it really is amazing that. Uh, what was my point? Oh yeah, keeping the community. I was like, they're keeping that community of people. I didn't want to go to the bid platform that's like a eBay style or, you know, there's a lot of, and a lot of people have a lot of success. We have friends that have auctions that, you know, they just do that digital where you, you put it up and let it run for a week. And, you know, then all of a sudden, you know, at the end of it, it ends like eBay. And I didn't want to do that. And our customers didn't want to do that. They didn't want to lose that community. Guess what? You guys still interact with each other. You still know each other. You know, everybody has fun on the bid panel. A couple of good laughs in a night. Um, sometimes more than a couple of good laughs in a night. You know, after 9 o'clock, cover the kids' ears. You know, it's like that. It's fun. But we didn't want to lose that community, so we came up with a whole innovative way to do this kind of overnight. Uh, we found out on a Saturday night or on a Friday, uh, Thursday night that, you know, oh my God, you know, they're going to be enforcing this no more than 10 people in a room BS. And we had to go ahead and switch it on over. And within 24 hours or 48 hours with very little sleep in the process, we switched over to a virtual format for you. A live virtual format, though. We have torch heads, uh, a, lot of, a lot of AC equipment here, guys. AC and tools, a lot of cool stuff. So, anyway, that's the story of how we went to live virtual. We knew, you know, even when we were live in person in-house that we were needing to add some internet onto it. And it just, uh, sometimes when you know you need some growth, sometimes you get some growth faster than you want it. And you have to grow. So, my note on that being a coach is, you know, give yourself your own growth before God comes along and tells you, I'm going to give you some growth. You know what I'm talking about? Uh, that's a digital. That one's a film camera. They're both cool Nikons. Uh, really neat stuff. And uh, one of the, uh, this is like one of those iRobot uh, vacuum cleaners. Pretty cool. I talk about, you know, George Jetson times, you know, <laughs> vacuum cleaner that runs itself. Who'd have thought 20, 30 years ago that would actually be a thing. Who'd have thought we'd have cars that can drive themselves? Elon has actually created self-driving Teslas. 
How crazy is that? I'm not a fan of electric cars, but uh, that's brilliant. Uh, brilliant idea. I'd be more of a fan of a solar car that you really don't have the batteries. Hmm, what a concept that would be. Anybody want to partner up and create solar cars? Let me know. All right, we got these really old books. Yes, that's about it for the night, guys. Um, we might have a few more pieces to get added in after the fact, but this is it. Huge, huge, huge auction for y'all. Tune in at bronsteinauction.com at any given time um, to...